That's right, ladies and gentlemen, broadcasting all week. Ain't you right here, the B? Hey, hey, hey. All week, we here, baby. Okay, breaking into new studios right now, and I thought it would be fitting that we have somebody um, to be our first guest in the new studios in L.A. It had to be somebody famous. Absolutely. Yeah. You know what I mean? It, it had to be somebody that I respect, that yeah. we all respect. Um, and it, it had to be somebody that had legacy, that had history to him, right? Right. Right? And so reason why we played that song, Why? And Heather, what was your comment when you heard that song? I was like, oh, my goodness. This sounds like the R&B that I used to love. Uh-huh. Like, it was very, you know, like that feeling when you heard those certain songs at a particular time. Yeah, man. And it felt real good, right? And yeah. we have, and that was a duet with Michael Jackson and his family members. And we have one of them right now with us, the one and only T.J. Jackson. Woo! T.J. T.J. Jackson is here. Hey, and I'm we here. have to have him because he's born and raised in California. That's it. Born this and is, raised in California, huh? This is my neck of the woods. This, mm-hmm. this is where I'm at. This is it. When you hear that song, man, what kind of what kind of thoughts go through your head? Bro? Uh, I smile uh-huh. because I think about my uncle. Yes, I yes. think about my uncle Michael. And there's a couple things. First of all, on the video uh-huh. for why, I remember getting ready for it. You know, this is our first video with Michael Jackson, yeah, right? Yeah. So I'm like, oh, man, what, what do I do? Do I need to dance? Do I need practice? <laughs> so we go on set, uh-huh. and here's my uncle just literally being a fool. <laughs> Clowning around. Clowning around Aww. every single take. And 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 t- till this day, it's my favorite video because of that. Because of that. Because it's the one time you see my Uncle Michael uh-huh. chilled out with his family, with his guard down, and, uh-huh. and it's the way we know him. Yeah. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? So it's a beautiful memory. For me. Oh man, TJ, thank you, man. Yeah. Yeah. I felt like yeah. hugging you right there, dog. Hey, man. I'm, I'm, <laughs> come on, Sway, let's do it. You ready? Can I hug you, <laughs> dog? Of course. You oh, hug, TJ. Come on, man. Yes. <laughs> happening Every in thug needs a hug. Everyone. Everyone needs a hug. <laughs> the three T days right there, baby, huh, man? Were well, y'all writing your own music back then? Uh, y- not that one. Okay. So that one was written by Babyface. Okay. Oh, wow, and that's Babyface. another story because our Uncle Michael, uh huh, he was recording his history album. I remember that. And he played You Are Not Alone before everyone else. Mm -hmm. And he played Why. And he said, Sony is telling me I have to get rid of one of these. And I don't know which one to get rid of. Mm. So literally, we could have said You Are Not Alone. Okay. But we were happy with Why. Yeah. So, because Why, there's actually a Michael Jackson version of just him on Why. Uh Uh-huh. So, um, but yeah, the, the other ones we wrote and produced, like Anything, which is still... Technically, our biggest song is the one we wrote yeah. and produced. Mike knew what he was doing when he chose You Are Not Alone. Man, I'm sorry. You can't. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, mean, you know. Why is a great song, but, <laughs> but that's why Mike is hey, who man. he is. That's why Mike. You get it? Nobody, <laughs> wow. Nobody's with me on that one, right? Oh, All right. Hey, man, I appreciate, um, in all honesty, your willingness to talk about your family. Yeah, you know, I, a lot of times folks don't want to talk about that sort of thing. True. You and, know what, Sway? I went through that. Okay. I went through that when I was younger, trying to establish my own lane, uh-huh. you know, my own identity. But I'm proud to be a Jackson. I'm Absolutely. proud of my family, man. Absolutely. And there's not a place in this world I go where where people aren't thanking me and saying, you're, you know, someone in your family's music has influenced me. Uh-huh. You know, usually always positive, and and that feels good. As you get older, you start to respect and and carry on that legacy with pride. Yeah. And and that's where I'm at. That's where you at, TJ Jackson. Man, we're gonna talk about your new music. Yes. I I I'm gonna share this with you. I you know and and nothing, you know, against those folks, uh, Wade Robinson, all these yeah. guys who yeah. did these documentaries. And, yeah. Um, man, it never sat well with me. Yeah. To hear you know, but maybe it's not my place to say, mm. you know. But uh, when you see those type of documentaries, I know the family was upset about yeah. this. Uh, what was your reaction? It pisses me off. Okay. Yeah. I mean, flat out, it pisses me off because. My uncle was nothing but giving and nice. Okay. Mm. And for them to try to change the narrative. And it, it's basically a four hour hit piece. Mm. Okay. If that's all it is, uh-huh. you know, and it's like going into a court case and hearing a prosecution and side of it and then saying, okay, what's the determination? Uh-huh. We don't even get a chance to defend. Yeah. And the media has done, a, in my opinion, a, a, a disservice by just allowing only negative things to come out. Because there's been so much neg- or positive stuff on our side yeah. that shows these guys aren't the truth. Okay. But the media doesn't want to hear it. Mm-hmm. You, so. you knew Wade, right? Did I knew him. <laughs> Man, he yeah. was begging for... for yeah, he <laughs> after my uncle passed, he really wanted to get to the funeral. And, uh-huh. and I've known him just growing up. Yeah. And my, my cousin dated him for almost 10 years. So. Oh, wow. Okay, oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. yeah, that whole <laughs> thing was, was what yep. ended that. <laughs> what? So. Britney Spears. That's what ended my cheated cousin. Cheated on Justin Timberlake with Wade Robson. And, and, and that's who cheated on my cousin. Oh! Yeah. Damn. 
Yeah, and and no no mention of the media. They don't want to talk about that. You okay. know what I mean? So do you forgive Oprah for when she did the interview uh, with the alleged victims, but I, then took it back? I, I try out of honor of my grandmother, yeah. who who taught us to forgive. Yeah, I guess that answer is somewhat yes, but I'll never forget that. Mm. If that makes sense, it I, I it, it upset me because when we wanted to say our piece or defend it, they didn't want to hear it. Oh, wow. Okay. TJ, okay. I want to ask then if you could help other people, because just as humans, like we all have social media, Instagram mm -hmm. and younger kids, you read a comment. Sometimes it's not flattering and you could just piss off your whole day. Yeah. You know, as you guys grew up and was reading and hearing so much, how did you deal with like is, is there something you can share to somebody else if you read something about your brother yeah. or your sister or a family member uh, can you share yeah that's a good question you know because growing up when i did at school i would hear things all the yeah. time mm -hmm. you know yeah. and it, it would break my heart and hurt me you know because that's my family that's my love yeah right. um but in today's time it's even worse because it, it surrounds you you can't go to bed without you know seeing things mm -hmm. you got to be strong you know you got to understand there's people at different places in their life some people are going through really dark moments and the only way they could deal with that is by spraying it out mm. you know what i mean so don't let anyone's issues or anyone's troubles affect what you're going through and that's a lot of times how i have to see it i mean there's comments still to this day i get all the time uh -huh. that are negative but to me, it's just a reflection of what they're going through. Right. Mm. You know, I'm just going to do me. Some people are going to like it. Some people are going to hate mm -hmm. it. And that's I got to be comfortable with that. So just be you and and be true. Yeah. TJ Thanks Jackson, man, that, this dude man. is amazing. Yeah. Yeah. I'm about to hug him again, Heather. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm always hugging Sway. I'm on Sway. All right. <laughs> <laughs> TJ got a new um, EP called Last Night um, yes. that's going to be coming out next year, right? It's actually coming out in a couple months. Oh, man. in a couple I'm months. I'm pushing it up. You're man. pushing it up? I'm pushing it okay, up. Okay, cool. Yeah. I want to talk about Insomnia as your new um, single. We're going to play that <laughs> momentarily. Good. Yes. Um, I appreciate you because um, I read that you were the guardian for Mike's kids, yeah. right? right? Prince um, Blanket, right? Yep. Okay. And, and Paris. And yeah. Paris, right? Yep. How? You seem like you're 17, bro. Like, what happened? Right. Why they grant it to you? <laughs> <laughs> so, you couple, take them to the club? Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> okay, so I, I have an older child. I have a 19 okay, year old. Okay, okay. And I'm, my son is actually the oldest grandchild. So when my uncle had Prince, his first son, my son was just a couple years later. Okay. So we used to talk about parenting a lot. So I kind of knew how he thought of as a parent. Okay. That and my mother was murdered when I was 16. I didn't know that. Okay. Yeah, man. So Sorry. I kind of could relate to that loss of a parent. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And my brothers and I, when the day it happened, we, we sat my grandmother down and said, we are here. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we are here 100%. Our, my, if it wasn't for my Uncle Michael, I wouldn't be here. I, don't, I, was, I was gone when my mother died. Yeah, mm -hmm. I can imagine. But he, even though he was the biggest artist on the planet, made a really big interest into my brothers and I to help us. Mm -hmm. And I just didn't feel like I could go through life and not do the same for him. Wow. You know what I mean? So it was a no brainer to me. Yeah. I, I couldn't look back in 10, 15 years and saying I didn't do anything to help. Mm -hmm. And and it's been it's been a big passion and a big a big feeling for me ever since and I'll always be there for my cousins. TJ Jackson, man. Shit, can I be your cousin? Right. <laughs> More yeah. hug and sway, yeah. relax. Yeah, I'm trying to it's get that cousin true. money. <laughs> <laughs> true, Tito's man. your dad? T Papa T's my father. Man, Papa Tito. T, man. Yeah. I'm trying to think. Did we meet uh, with Tito in Vegas? It, uh, what I did to, uh, I hosted, I don't even know what I hosted. They Billboard asked me. or something? No, 60th yeah. anniversary. Kel come and just tell me, Kelly, what did I host? Just, you know, I can't read lips. Just, what was it? His birthday. Oh, oh. oh. In Vegas, his Ooh. 60th birthday. Okay. I hosted that. Okay. And Papa T came out. He's, man, he's he, the coolest cat, man. Oh, and I, my God. As I get older, mm -hmm. I respect him. I always loved him, but I respect him more. Yeah. You know, for, for what he goes through. And, and I'm thankful he that he broke that string. Yeah. You know, that started this whole thing, mm -hmm. this whole Jackson thing. So I love you, Pops. Oh, that's, oh man. We that's often good. debate. So we've had <laughs> Marlon Wayans here okay. and then Wayans clan. Mm -hmm. And we asked Marlon. Whose family, entertainment family, is bigger? So we debate between the Marleys, okay. the Jacksons, Ooh. and the Wayans. Okay. And Marlon said he thinks that it's the Marleys okay. because Bob was just the universe. But he then, planted his seed on soils around the world. world. But okay. then now you're saying, like, so you have a son that's 19. How many is it of y'all? Oh, there's a lot of us. Wow. More than the Wayans family? Because the Wayans are pretty thick, too. They're they deep. are. They are. And... Um, 
for, first of all, shout out to the Waynes. Yeah, I have a, a solid relationship with. Yeah, them as we well. love we love the great them. people. Yeah. But um, I, I don't know if we can overtake the the Marleys. You know, we got a lot of us. Though. Okay, There's, yeah. I mean, not I got nine uncles and aunts total, and then we wow. all they all got busy too. So <laughs> they got their kids, and then and and I didn't fall too far from that. So tree. you okay. think y'all? <laughs> you phone. think y'all are second? You think the Wayans are third? You I, Marleys, I so. Jacksons. I, there's Wayans. a lot of us Jacksons. A lot of sex happening in these oh, I'm trying to tell you on this oh, coast. Procreation. <laughs> that's, why they, that's why they keep making these songs. I know what TJ's up to. Insomnia. Yeah, I'm up all night thinking about wow. you. Oh, man. It's, it's all about love. It's, man. it's all about love. It's all about love. Wow. Do the Kardashians count as an entertainment family? They're the not deeper than the uh, sisters, you know. This, this, yeah. <laughs> it's not deeper. How many babies can they have? You know what's funny, though? See, because I know probably people bring up in high school dating Kim Kardashian. Is that yeah. true, first of it's all? It's 100% true. You dated Kim? Yeah, man. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, Kim and I went to each other's proms. Uh, we dated for a couple years in high school, and um, yeah. I know, you know, everyone has their, you know, vision or saying of what that family is, but for me, they're a family to me because when my mother passed, um, Chris and the whole family really took me in. Uh -huh. And, um, you know, it, I was I'm telling you guys, I was so shook when my mother passed. I, can imagine, bro. I was I was gone. You know, I went from a straight A student to not even caring, you know, uh -huh. and um, my uncle, my grandmother, my father and and Chris and the and other people. But that family really helped me. Yeah, and I always respect them for that. Yeah, man, that's a tight oh. bond, man. We've yeah. had them all on the show. They they mm -hmm. great every time they yeah. come to the show. I always mm -hmm. have fun uh, with them. Yeah. You know, that's um that's interesting. We we're getting to learn yeah. about <laughs> TJ here, <laughs> okay? And uh, you mentioned that you were a straight A student and your grades dropped, but yeah. you eventually went and sought out higher education. That's right. And you got a master's degree, right? I, I okay. So uh, okay, let me let me correct that. Okay. Um, I, I struggled for a bit, okay. but not too long. And then I applied to the number one business school. Okay. Wharton. Mm -hmm. Wharton, yep. And I got accepted. Woo! Okay. Um, and I never went. Oh, you never oh. went? No, Sway, okay. because look, I was selling out arenas in Europe with my brothers okay. at 3T. Ow. Did you just stunt? <laughs> <laughs> uh, but, but, but here's the thing. My uncle would call me in the middle of the night, my Uncle Michael, at 2 in the morning and say, Applehead, please tell me you're going to that school. <laughs> yeah, he called me. Applehead, I But see he why. said, please tell me you're going to that school. Uh-huh. Uh, which school? The Wharton. I, I just had meetings with people. They told me you have to go. I didn't listen. And still to this day, that's probably my only regret in life is that I should have probably went straight there. But I, did, I felt bad stopping my career and, and making my brother stop. They're uh -huh. both older than me mm. and they decided to go the music route. And I felt loyalty to do that. Yeah. So I did eventually get my, my degree in okay. business okay. from UMass. There you go, man. TJ yeah. Jackson, he's smart, too. I have to. All of this and smart. let uh -uh. you defer it. Um, I, you know what? I didn't even check. It was about 10 years later. Yeah. And, okay. and I needed to do, I was still traveling, working. So they didn't have an internet program. So an online program. So right. I ended up just doing that route with UMass. I got you. So now we're entering the next chapter for TJ. Yes. You know, uh, are you still a guardian? I'm still a guardian for one. For just one of them. You guys call him Blanket, but uh -huh. he's BG. BG. Okay, BG. so BG. Yeah. Shout out to BG. Yeah, good guy. Beautiful guy. Be amazing. Yeah, I amazing. could just, I don't know him, but I've watched, I've seen him in different. Uh, old soul. Yeah. He's an old soul. Okay. Um, and so you had to kind of branch off in a sense, away from the family, not in a negative way, yeah. to really kind of refocus your music career, yeah. right? And so how did that play out? How has that worked for you? So over the last couple of years, you know, it, it being Guardian and just being a Jackson, it can be difficult. Okay. So I had to, every now and then, every couple of months, I'd go out to Nashville to just write and clear my mind. And um, after mm. doing that for a couple of years, I was like, I, I should be doing my own thing. Uh -huh. And I started writing my own and, and producing my own stuff out in, in Nashville with, with a couple of producers, David Tulin. But um, I had to do that way because uh -huh. growing up Jackson from the beginning, my family's very supportive and protective. So I needed to branch out and be me. Uh -huh. I had to, you know, I didn't want to be, again, y you all know I love my, my family, but I had to do TJ. I had to be myself. Uh -huh. And to do that, I had to get away. And so, and as a result of that, yeah, uh, we have this new project yes. last night. Yes. Uh, what do you write about? Like, are you in love right now? Or? I, well, I'm married. So okay, yeah, so I, you're I, in love, but you could be married and not be in love. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> so, that's true. <laughs> you, know. um, you write about life. Yeah. 
you know, again, what my uncle always, and I keep, that's how much of an influence he had on me, but he was so big on being true and writing about what's in your heart because mm-hmm. the, the, the audience will hear it if it's not the truth. Mm-hmm. So I write about life, my, my struggles, my happiness, my, my bliss. Insomnia is a story about my life. Okay. You know? Based and on a true story? It's based on a true experience. Give, give me some of the lyrics. Just say them right now. It's just yeah. insomnia, just you and me. Insomnia, uh, n- no need for sleep. So happy I can tell if I'm living or dreaming. It's beautiful insomnia. Mm-hmm. And I wanted to switch up insomnia. You know, insomnia is always a negative thing. Yeah. I can't right. sleep. Uh, no, sometimes it could be beautiful. If you're in love and uh, I'm looking in his eyes. It's <laughs> no, I'm, a, yeah, I'm, I'm, right. this I'm losing <laughs> sway over here. No, I'm looking at you like... <laughs> No, that's what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, so he's yeah, looking at me like... And you got a tantalizing voice, TJ. Be careful. You I want to have a good series on Star. <laughs> <laughs> no, but <laughs> insomnia, <laughs> it could be a good thing. If yeah. you're with your with your with with that person, yes. uh-huh. you don't want that night to end. Yes. And that's what insomnia Aww, is. shout out to Damn, Carl. Damn, man, I like that. Sway be staying up late. He always <laughs> come to work and say he can't sleep. <laughs> what happened to you at night now, Sway? Shit, I don't know, man. It ain't that, though. <laughs> it's beautiful, yeah, it's beautiful. I'll be watching alone on you know, that series I watch on <laughs> TV. That's beautiful. So you lay up. You, you're so in love that you can't even sleep. Yeah, man. Because the moment you sleep takes you away from so that. It, takes, it ends yeah, the night. It nice. ends the night. And and that that's I wanted to do a spin on that. It's you know there could be a such thing as beautiful insomnia, and that's that's what this song's about. T J Jackson, eight 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 seven four two three three four five. Uh, you want to speak with him? Give us a call now. We're gonna play the song. Yes. I want to hear about this video that T J says. Wait, they're gonna ban it. We're <laughs> oh, gonna wow. find out what that's all about up next. Yeah. It's insomnia. Baby, you got me. I can't I can't even sleep thinking of you. I try. I tried and I tried, but when I sleep, I'm not with you. Insomnia. That was the remix right there, baby. <laughs> That's what's yeah. right. Whenever he loves like a it. song, he latches himself I, I try to attach myself to it. Yeah. I, that wasn't my best work, though. It's okay. Are you all right with that? <laughs> I'm fine. All right, we could do it. You want to do it again? <laughs> Give me the back of the song. You know, life ain't worth living if I can't be awake and you in front of me. Insomnia. Oh, what about that, TJ? No. Uh, hey, that was better. That was better. That was better. All right, TJ right. Jackson's here, man. That's the remix. <laughs> Let's print it that way. It's out. Uh, <laughs> it's coming out Friday, right? Yes, sir. Okay, so people will be able to, you know, stream it and all the all that good stuff, all the digital platforms, all that stuff. Congratulations. Yes, Thank you, man. Sounds good. Thank you, man. It's it's hard when you were uh, when you've been out. And you put music out for mm-hmm. so long yeah. to still be uh, cognizant enough to make music that sounds current. Mm. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like to be progressive minded, open minded enough, yeah. you know, to have that kind of creativity. <sighs> and you're not stuck in a rut. That's true. Right. And I and I wanted to do something for for my fans that would be different, something that would catch them off. Mm-hmm. Um, but at the same time, still latch on to my R&B core. Yeah. And my soul core. Mm-hmm. And I wanted it to, to be also be modern, but a throwback. So I tr- there's a lot of checks I wanted to cross. Mm-hmm. And, I, and I feel this song. That's why I'm coming with it first. That's why you come. It feels right, man. Yeah. And then and there's a lot of new R&B artists that are out. A lot of great ones. Well, who are you listening to out of the fresh new ones? Uh, like Daniel Caesar, all these guys. Daniel Caesar's Black. great. Uh-huh. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Leon Bridges. Oh yes. Leon's Leon's a, a yeah. man. Um, Michael Kiwanuka. Uh-huh. Um, there's just so many. I said that like I knew Michael. I didn't know Michael. He's yeah. a British cat, and huh. he, he's solid. Kind of mm-hmm. He's solid. He's dope. He kind of put me on this this path of soul. Uh-huh. Um, I shouldn't say it like that, but that old soul kind of feel. Michael's Michael's no joke. Okay, Roll James, that's the homie. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I love okay. Bro. Um, this video. Yes. First thing Sway. I walked out before you even said good morning, Sway. Sway, I'm they're gonna you. ban the video. I'm telling like, you. Why, why? What's going on with this? It's 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 a video. It's you ain't seen a Jackson like this way. Whoa. Okay. Damn, I've seen Jacksons many ways. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't seen it this way. It's just different. It's uh, it's sexy. Uh-huh. Your cheeks it's, is out. Um. Uh, <laughs> you gotta watch it. <laughs> when does it come out? It comes out uh, probably the thirteenth. Um, I'm messing around with the date. You know, I, I I'm really honestly worried YouTube won't allow it. YouTube won't allow it. Damn, what you showing? Penis? <laughs> no, it, it ain't there. 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 But it's it's close. It's close. It's close. Yeah, but not on me. So the fellas can watch and and enjoy it. Oh. But um. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think I gotta edit it down a bit. This so we're we're gonna edit it down a bit. 
Um, but it's still going to be something, something, mm-hmm. something I say strong. Don't, I say don't edit it down. <laughs> and see what happens. <laughs> see what it's happens. art. Yeah. yeah, you know. It is art. It's mm-hmm. beautiful. Yeah. You know, and again, it's the songs about love. Mm-hmm. You know, and, and sometimes love can get there. And there's nothing wrong with that. Is your wife the leading lady? Not in this video. Oh, okay. That's more but sacred. She, but, but she is, but not in this video. And it's funny, and I'm going to share this. Yes. Because she's a very strong woman. But she was mad at me that day. Because of the video. I think so. Wow. I think so, Sway. Who was the she, she wouldn't say it. Uh-huh. But she, you know, you know, as a guy, you know when, you're, when your lady's a little, not a little upset. Uh, yeah. She's yeah. short it. Yeah. She, she's short on answers. So what'd you come home with? She was there, though. She, oh. she, she was, was on there. set. She was on set, and, you know, uh, you know, and then, then she was off set. <laughs> offset. So she offset. was offset. <laughs> yeah, and then uh, she didn't really come back, so I'm checking on her. It's yeah. like, but you know, it is what it is, and, I, and she knows she has my heart. She hated to see the way you acted out those scenes. I think she didn't think I was that good of an actor. Yeah, so she, you yeah. know, and so she believed you was really taking advantage of the moment. <laughs> <laughs> with this call, I love the, her, the co-star. Who's the co-star in it? She's a she's a French um, woman by the name of Stella, and she was a huge Three T fan and a fan of mine. Oh, she went off in the video. So, wow, <laughs> Yo, so, living out her uh, fantasy. Uh, yeah, so uh, she's this beautiful, beautiful, yeah. sweet young lady. But she took advantage of that. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people in LA have open marriages. I realize. I, I see that. Yeah, is that something that conversation has been brought to you? Um, no, not okay. not, <laughs> not, not within my marriage. But okay. um, it is it is a growing trend, mm-hmm. you know. And I don't know. Uh, how, I, I'm trying to be progressive in life, but I don't know how <laughs> that can work, you know. But you know, I'm not. If it's working for people, you know, props to you. Right. All right, T.J. Jackson is here. We got uh, Mark on the line from Atlanta. We just played his new song, Insomnia. What are you thinking, Mark? What What's are you up, thinking, Mizar? bro? Hey, Mark. Amazing, man. Amazing. What the fuck, yeah. man? Cool, Mark. How do, you just, how do you just drop a song about insomnia and kill it? Oh, my God. Hey, Mark. That song is amazing, man. I appreciate that, man. I, re- I really appreciate that. I, I just put my passion into it and, and all the learnings I got from my family. Mm-hmm. I try to stay humble and, yes. you know, and just, just do what I feel and, and hope there's reactions just like you had. So thank you. Hey, Mark, and follow TJ. Give out your social, too. So it's TJ Jackson 9 on Insta and um, TJ Jackson World on Facebook and then just TJ Jackson on Twitter. But TJJackson.com is for my website. Okay. TJ, real quick, you mentioned family, and I know we spend a lot of time talking about the men in your family, but yeah. a lot of times the women yes. in your family get overlooked. Who's that auntie? Like, you go to her house for fried chicken and Thanksgiving. <laughs> Which one of your aunts uh, um, are like that? I, I would say, for me, yeah. my Aunt Latoya. She's mm. she, she's always been that one who's called um, you know, my birthday or my kid's birthday and Dope. just say, just want to check on you, sweetie. My Auntie Latoya's an angel. And I love her tremendously. And then if, if we're going to talk about women, we have to talk about Miss Catherine, mm. um, my grandmother, yes. the matriarch. Yes, and I, I told her this a couple of weeks ago. Um, I told her, Grandma, you don't hear this enough from anyone in the family, but without you, we wouldn't be where we're at. Absolutely. Her love is, is second to none. Mm-hmm. Mm. And um, my grandmother is a queen, and I always love and respect her. And she was like, you, you're going to make me cry, baby. That's what she was saying. I was uh-huh. like, Grandma, you need to hear it because I know you're not hearing it enough, and I want to make sure you know that. And that's the truth. That is the truth. That's She's dope. the glue to the whole family. Absolutely. So, I believe that, man. Yeah. T.J. Jackson, man. And Latoya's yeah. been on the show before, so, yeah, yeah we, she, we had a good time. You. Yeah, shout out Latoya to Latoya. did come to the show. Yeah, we had fun. <laughs> she was so funny. Yeah, she's, she's great. She's, she's hilarious. Great, yeah. And I she's sat, did a one-on-one with Janet, too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Janet. yeah, 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 man. Doing she, her she, thing. She was nice, man. Yeah. Very sociable. I went into the green room and just fake conversation until <laughs> I got her to talk. You know, I'm like, Creep. Janet, Penny going to talk to me before <laughs> this right. thing is over. You know, so. That's right. Uh, we got Troy on the line from Texas. Troy, what do you think of the song? What's up, Troy? Yeah. Hey, what's up, y'all? Uh, man, this is an uh, honor to uh, be talking to you guys. Uh, I would listen to you guys every day, first-time caller. Uh, TJ, that was banging, man. Oh, man. Uh, I, was, I got a 12 here in the back of the trunk, and I was headed to work, and I just thought I was just banging it, man. And uh, by the way, I don't mean to be uh, – not trying to be rude or anything, but when the song was playing, when TJ's song was playing, I heard you guys in the background 
<laughs> talking while the, the song was gone. I thought that was pretty funny. I want to hey, throw that in there, but uh, you guys are awesome, man. What it's, are we uh, wait, wait, man. What, what, what did we prove it? What did we say? <laughs> I don't know what y'all am saying. I just heard it. <laughs> <laughs> Through the whole song? <laughs> no, it was like it was parts of the song. But okay. you guys were we'll awesome, man. We'll I, I loved everything. I love you guys. All right. Hey, 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 man. Hey, Troy, you're a citizen. Sway the morning. So Thank are you, you Mark. Thank All you. Right. TJ, um, I think this is the first of a series of conversations we're going to have with cool, you. Man. I'm yes. here, man. And I appreciate your honesty. You're a very centered individual. Yeah. Uh, Try to and be, spiritually man. sound. That's it. Um, and I can appreciate that. We sense that. This ain't just a microphone and camera thing for mm-hmm. us. We, When I look at you like this, I'm really connecting. And you can see the whole room has that feeling about you. Thank we you love man. your family. Yes. Thank mm-hmm. you, man. And pl- please Thank tell you. grandmother we said that. She's going to be like, who? But then we'll tell <laughs> yeah. her anyway. I uh, will. Okay. I will. And and I love you too, Sway. And, you, and the whole family here, thank you guys you. have been nothing but great to us. Absolutely. And it means a lot to us. So man. thank you. Absolutely. TJ Jackson, man. Yeah. Make sure you follow him. Yes. He's here, baby. What's your social media? Right. Uh, Once again. Here, but, uh, yeah. Okay. Insta- Instagram's TJ Jackson 9. Twitter's just TJ Jackson, okay. and Facebook is TJ nice. Jackson World. I'm okay. coming for my hug. All right, cool. <laughs> and then, oh, so we're going to play the song again. It's yeah, a new studio, to, so yeah. we're okay. breaking in the new studio. Okay. <laughs> Troy tried to get OQ fired. Yeah, I see Troy, what you doing? You a hater, <laughs> Troy. You don't have to say that. <laughs> so we're going to play the song again, and then make sure the mics are off, and we want you to hear it again. It's Insomnia by TJ Jackson. Last night is the EP. It's coming out in the next few months. Yep. We'll probably have them up at Sirius XM doing a live performance. Yep. Right? Uh, maybe for Heart and Soul. Ooh. Or 